morning, everybody. This is Linda Jo Hefner, the author of Tainted Seas, and now the upcoming author of a new book. This one is a historical fiction, and in a historical fiction, uh, you usually break base it on things that are accurate for that time, but you can take a little liberties with it. So the other side of the gangplank <clears throat> is now on pre-order on Amazon and Barnes and Noble. Please don't look at the cover. They just, my publisher is really pushing me. So I, um, they put out what they call a placement cover. It's not going to be the other one. As you remember, the cover for Tainted Seas is so dynamic. And the same man that designed that cover will be doing the new cover for the other side of the gangplank. And he is, he's an expert. I have nothing bad to say about Dudley Court Press. They have been fantastic. They're the best. But this morning, I woke up and I got a message from one of my neighbors that maybe later on, uh, they'd like to deliver me a surprise. So I got this nice little note that says Linda Joe on it. And it came with a card. And the, I'll read you the card. I can't fake it. i got to put my glasses on. It says, Linda Joe, thank you so much for taking the time to meet with us and autograph my cousin's copy of Tainted Seas. Keep up the grand writing, Sandy and Fred. And along with it, and this is why I'm not editing right now, is a whole container of homemade cookies. Wow, being the cookie monster, I couldn't let those go to waste. So I'm out here enjoying my cookies with my glass of milk. I may be the number one uh, kid in the world, but I do love my milk. And I have a couple cookies here, and I'm going to enjoy them. So <clears throat> what happens now with uh, the other side of the gangplank? Well, right now I'm busy editing and you may notice that some of my posts go out fairly early in the morning i sometimes start editing at 4 30 in the morning because my brain is alive then my brain works best in the morning so i get up and i write it may not be perfect the first time i write but i do that but right now i'm doing editing and editing is editing is the most grueling hard work. I'd rather write, write five books than do the editing. So I'm doing the editing with my personal editor. That's a young lady that lives here who does this for a living, but not, she doesn't do books. She does uh, technical writing, but she does this as a sideline and she's magnificent. She doesn't write for me, but she will move things around a little bit my writing around and if she doesn't like something she very politely says rewrite it and then I get it back again so that's what I'm doing now and I just rewrote uh, completely one of the chapters because my editor said it's too Cinderella and we can't have all Cinderella you have to have something that gives people tension and makes them concerned and not every character can be perfect, like my Melissa was up to this point. Everybody has a dark side. So this is going to point out Melissa's dark side. And I think you'll like this one because in this one, she's the bad person and the Air Force Lieutenant is the good man. So that's what's happening right now. I'm editing, I'm working. My eyes are kind of dead from all this, and uh, you know, you may notice I have a few extra circles and wrinkles under my eyes. It's from being, it's from staring at this computer too long. So I'm enjoying doing that. This book, then, after Terry's done with it, my editor will go to the publisher, and then I get the joy of doing the editing all over again with Dudley Court's press editor, and she's fantastic too. She's really good. She, and I, if you read Tainted Seas, no one has reported an error in that book at all. No grammar errors, no spelling errors, no missed words. So between the two editors, mine and the one from Dudley Court Press, they've done their job. It's very difficult 
<clears throat> to write 153,300 and some words and not goof up. Because when you write it yourself, you're too close. You're too close to hear, to see where you made a mistake. By the time you're done writing a book, you almost know it by heart. You almost know it by heart. So the publisher's editor will go through it. The young man that designed the cover for Tainted Seas will be designing the new cover for the other side of the gangplank. And he is a fantastic designer. I think you'll enjoy the new cover. So if you want to pre-order, if you enjoy Tainted Seas, uh, you can go to Amazon or Barnes & Noble and type in my name, Linda Jo Hefner. And it'll show both Tainted Seas and also the other side of the gangplank. Now you can pre-order it now, uh, which might be to your advantage because last time there was such a fury, such a fast amount of people that wanted Tainted Seas that the printers you know, they print overnight, but still the printers are having trouble keeping up with the demand. But if you get your pre-order now, you can get in the front of the line. And again, with all of my three books, Tainted Seas, On the Other Side of the Gangplank, and At the Wall, the proceeds, all of my proceeds, my profit, the money that I make, and a portion of Dudley Quartz Press profit, is donated to my veterans groups. So guys, I want to thank you for joining in with me today. I'm going back to my cookies. They look wonderful. I mean, I've got great ones here. I'm enjoying a chocolate chip and, oh gosh, I don't know, some kind of nut bar. I don't know how people have time to bake cookies. I'm retired and I have barely time to keep going. So as always, I thank you for your support. And I thank you for always being there for me because sometimes, folks, I think that had I not announced that I was writing a book, I would have quit. But every time I thought of that, I thought, no, people are looking for a book and I have to do it. Besides, my husband's story had to be told. So right now, Tainted Seas is on sale on Amazon. It's the limited time sale reduced by 14%, and it's the most inexpensive place to buy Tainted Seas right now. Also at the local uh, Barnes & Noble, my local Barnes & Noble, copies are starting <coughs> to appear on the shelf. There were seven the last time I checked, and five, according to the reports. But if you go into Barnes & Noble, Ask for my book and tell them you want it right away, and then they'll offer to order it off the, off the uh, thing and say, no, no, I can get it faster from Amazon. This is what's happening, and my book now is in the Lehigh Valley. It's in a, a Barnes & Noble in Canada, and now in Florida, in a few of them. So, it, you know, it's just, be honest, say you were looking for my book. And then say, no, 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 you know, I'll order it from Amazon. So as usual, guys, I thank you. It's a lovely day in Florida, and I'm going to share it with you. And I'll thank you with a virtual kiss and a virtual hug. And this is Linda Jo Hefner, the author now of Tainted Seas and The Other Side of the Gangplank, saying goodbye for now. And I'll pop in again to see you soon. Stay safe.